know. Everyone else knew that's not fair. Well, we don't have some secrets. Uh, I chatted to you earlier on, and um, you're inspiring to talk to as well as to watch the achievements. But take us back to April when everybody suddenly found out who you were and what you went through during that, uh, that two weeks or more. Yeah, it was the most amazing experience. I you know, didn't expect it to be anything like that. And even now when I think back, I you know, just can't believe it and the support I got and the donations coming in and the messages and you know, people coming to walk with me, just everything. The whole thing was just you know, overwhelming and you know, I'm just still in shock from it all and been busy ever since. It's just you know, changed everything really. Uh, I think you're a mum, is it to Maisie? Yeah, that's um, right. Which would be a challenge enough. Um, what on earth? Yeah, hard. <laughs> <laughs> I can imagine. Um, what on earth came to your head to make to decide to do this? Because you know you've got enough challenges day to day, haven't you? Um, yeah, I've got to chase after Maisie. <laughs> so I need to get up right and, and walk. But no, I think um, yeah, it seemed a good idea at the time. I had walked in it when I said I'd do it, and then um, I started training in January and had three months to learn, and I got in it, and it was really hard. And I can't feel my legs at all, so it's not just kind of physical, it's mentally concentrating on every step. And 26 miles is quite a long way. I kept looking at the map and going, oh, poor Danny's getting the map out all the time, going, how much further have I gone? And it's like, oh, no, it's at all. Um, but yeah, no, it was, you know, I'm so pleased I took the challenge on and just got on with it and decided to do it because you know, it just has been unbelievable. Well, I said at the start that sort of one of the words was inspiration. I think everybody here would surely agree that if you want inspiration, look no further. 